A local MMA fighter and martial arts instructor is on a slow road to recovery after falling more than 50 feet from an overpass into the Guadalupe River. KPIX 5's Devin Feely tells us it's still a mystery on exactly what happened. Devin? Yeah, that's exactly right. This is the San Jose studio where Sam Romero trained and worked with children for several years. Now, here's the good news about his condition. He has survived several surgeries. He, the breathing tube that he was depending on has been removed. He is out of a coma, and he has been transferred to another hospital. And all of the students that he's worked with and the trainers here are praying for his speedy recovery. He was like, yeah, I'm ready to fight. I'm ready to get out of here. I'm ready to go home. If there's one thing that Sam Romero knows, it's how to get back up after being knocked down. They were worried that he wasn't going to be able to walk, but when I saw him, he was moving his toes. He was in high spirits. He was smiling. He was like, hey, Carlos, I, I miss you. I love you, man. The 23-year-old professional mixed martial artist has quite a fight ahead of him. A week ago, a passerby found Sam floating in the Guadalupe River. It appears that he had been pushed or perhaps had fallen or jumped from Highway 87, and he was in bad shape. His back was broken, his pelvis and elbow fractured, he had a collapsed lung and a ruptured artery in his heart. Family and friends say he has tapped into the same tenacity he once used in the ring for his recovery. He's moving his hands, he's moving his feet, and uh, he's, he's off the breathing tube. He's pretty much... Uh, and you know, recovered well, and he's looking to get back here on the mats. Sam's memory is as battered as his body is bruised and broken. He has no recollection of how he ended up in the river. He had his wallet when he was found, but the prize money from a fight two days before was missing. It's a mystery the CHP is trying to unravel as he focuses on what's likely to be the fight of and for his life. Physical and mental strength is going to carry him a long way. So Sam's family and friends says that his recovery is likely to be measured in weeks and months, but they say it is almost miraculous what he has been able to accomplish in just a matter of days. In San Jose, Devin Feely, KPIX 5.